Right now at 5 o'clock, a manhunt is underway for a suspect who led authorities on a police chase this morning. And during the chase, police say the suspect actually hit a construction worker and then sped off. News 9's Kaylee Bourgeois is live in Luther now with the latest on the search. Kaylee. Carl, this is just one of many areas that police and police dogs have been looking for the suspect since this morning. And really, this all started with a simple traffic violation. Just after 8 a.m., Luther Police Chief David Randall tried to pull a car over for crossing double lines, but the car didn't stop. When I called it in, saying that this vehicle wouldn't stop, he swerved to the southbound lane of 66, striking a construction worker. The car, reported stolen this morning, went off the Route 66 pavement, and the driver took off into a nearby field. They have tracks, and they're trying to follow up on leads on that. One lead led police to Donna Standard's nearby Luther home, where the suspect can be seen trying to get inside on surveillance video. Standard was home at the time. And I just waited and tried to see, you know, I checked everything, make sure he wasn't trying to get in anywhere else. Um, I just walked around and I called 911. The suspect was then spotted in Lincoln County just before noon walking down the road. Law enforcement from all over helped search throughout the afternoon. Meanwhile, they were informed the construction worker has been released from the hospital doing okay, something his boss is grateful for. Everybody's shaking up. We're emotionally on edge right now trying to deal with all of this. Nearly 10 hours later, the man who started it all is still on the run, and the search continues. While that search is still on, it is winding down a bit. Police say there's a strong possibility this guy got picked up in a car by someone, but they're still asking that you keep an eye out for him. They really want you to call 911 if they think you see him. And as this situation rapidly develops, even after the newscast, you can stay up to date with any developments on the News 9 app. On the scene, on the story in Luther, Kaylee Bourgeois, News 9.